Hi, in today's video I'm going to show you how to install GoGo Loco onto your avatar in 2024. We're gonna do the version in that include, includes flying. So first things that you need is your project with your avatar and GoGo Loco. Um, you can get GoGo Loco on Fronada's Gum route for free. Current version, the newest one is 183. So we just get it here, download the Unity package. Then you find the Unity package, double click, and it's gonna import it into your project. After you've done with that, you go to your avatar, you click on it in hierarchy, scroll down in the avatar descriptor, and click all these four and also the city. Now it's filled automatically, but I'm gonna show you. And now we need to figure out if your avatar is using right defaults off or on. And you can do that by looking, for example, in your FX layer, if you have one. And then you're going to see, uh, yes, this uses right defaults on. So I shall use right defaults on controllers. So you go back and you can find the controllers for right defaults in the controllers WD folder. And you just click and drag every single one of them in the corresponding slot. You can see how they're named after the slot, so it's quite easy to do. Uh, action, then we have the gesture. Now we need to add the sitting and T-pose. And to add flying, we also need to add the FX layer. But our avatar already has one, and we don't want to make it again from scratch. So for that, you're going to need a tool called called Avatar 3.0 Manager from VR Labs. You can find the Unity package on this website. I'm gonna link it in the description. So after you download it and imported the package, there should be this uh, VR Labs tab in your Unity and it should say Avatar 3.0 Manager, so you click it. And you drag your avatar here, like this. And you find the FX layer, click. And then add animator to merge. And then you drag the Google local FX layer. And you can either merge on new or on, on current. It's really your decision if you want to keep a backup. And I'm going to merge on current. And another thing we need to do is we need to add the parameters. So we're going to, in the VR Labs Manager, our avatar already has parameters, so we cannot just drag and drop the GoGo logo parameters, so we're going to merge them again. So I'm going to copy from GoGo logo Beyond, which Beyond is for the version with flying, copy parameters, and there we go. And now we have uh, here the menu, Go Beyond menu, which is this one. So I'm going to lock my unit here. I'm going to go to my avatar and I'm going to add GoGo logo menu to my own menu that I have already. Uh, I don't need this, so I'm gonna just like change this to the sub menu, call it go go logo, drag the beyond menu in the slot, and that should connect the uh, go go logo to my menu, so I should be able to operate it from game in game. And the last thing we need to do is we need to drag the prefab, the flying prefab, onto the avatar. And then you find this constraint and you need to put your character's head bone there for flying to work. So we're just gonna drag it and there we go. And uh, that's it. Now you have GoGo Loco uh, on your avatar and you can use all the functions. Like and subscribe, let me know what you think and I'll see you in the next video.